For practice at self-check 4.8 scanner logical error, we are given code right here that has logical errors inside of it. We need to find the logical errors and fix them without making too many modifications to the code. Also that it prints out the same thing as it should. We are just checking the logic of it. So first we have this scanner, which looks good. It takes system input. And then we have this system.out.print, which asks the user for a number. Then we are storing this number inside of our scanned integer. And then we are comparing this number now. So we have if the number modulus two is equal to zero, this is basically saying if our number is even, we are going to be inside of this if statement. If not, we're not gonna do anything. Next, we have if our number modulus three is equal to zero, it's divisible by, by three. Well, if we have something that is divisible by three, like let's say we have an 18, because we need it to be even for it to get in here. So our even number is 18, modulus two is zero, so we can be inside of our else statement. Now we have 18 modulus three. The remainder of this is equal to zero, so this is divisible by six. And then our else statement would mean that it's odd. So I press submit just so we could see what errors we have here. We passed these two tests, but we can see that we failed this test. So we can use this failure to look back at our code. Expected output is typing number, five is entered, and it should output odd. So we need to have an else statement that follows this outside if. We're gonna have an else statement here, and it's just going to say odd because if it's not even, it's going to be odd. If it were even, it would be in this if statement. So we're gonna have our else statement. We can copy this print line right here because all we need to write is odd. Pressing submit, we have passed four out of six tests. So it seems we have fixed this error. Now we have another error down here. This last error that we are getting is a problem with our in case for loop. We can see that this is an even number, so it will be inside of this if statement. We know both of these numbers are not divisible by three. So we are not going to be inside of this if statement, we are going to be inside of this else statement and print out odd. However, these numbers are not odd. It shouldn't print out anything. Since it shouldn't print out every anything, we need to make our else statement into an else if statement. So it's more specific on what output we get. So. We'll just, instead of having an else right here, we'll say else if, and then in parentheses, we need to write if our number modulus two does not equal zero, we are going to put odd. So we can just copy this. And this is the code for an even number. Change this, we could just change this to one actually. Submitting this, we can see that we've passed all six tests. All six tests are passed with our code written successfully now. And this is the answer to this practice itself check 4.8 problem.